Lester received his first dose of the AstraZeneca vaccine. Will he be getting a second dose of the AstraZeneca vaccine? Two doses of Pfizer or Moderna or one dose of uh, Pfizer or Moderna in the future? Which one will it be? Uh, Mr. Speaker, I, I thank the uh, Honourable Member for Nose Hill for her uh, questions about my well-being. Uh, let me assure her that I uh, talked to my doctor just last week. And he recommended that I indeed get a second dose of AstraZeneca uh, in uh, the coming uh, weeks or months uh, when it becomes available, uh, when, uh, when, the recommend, when my turn comes up in the, month of Ontario, in the province of Ontario. Uh, that is uh, what I am focused on doing. I know there are questions being asked around the world about the data that involves mixing and max matching doses. There are no recommendations around that yet, but I know scientists are leaning in carefully to see if it, uh, it may be the right option for many people. The Prime Minister and the government don't make health recommendations. That's not my job. My job is to, is I shared, uh, for example, what uh, the uh, member asked, what advice I personally got from my doctor. I certainly encourage all Canadians to talk to their doctors. Across this country right now, we will have received 50 million doses of vaccines uh, by the end of June. Uh, we will continue to make recommendations. We will continue to see uh, Health Canada, uh, NACI, and provincial uh, deciders making recommendations about how and when all Canadians can get vaccinated. But I will uh, take this moment to thank everyone who stepped up and got a first dose of vaccines. Congratulate those who've, many who've already received their two doses of vaccines and encourage everyone else to get vaccinated as soon as possible so we can have a much better summer.